AZ card, and I'll be opening up my last box of uh, GBT07. So, yep, let's go ahead and get into this. Really hoping to pull an SP pack or something just amazing. All right. Uh, yeah. This time we have the medical bomber nurse, and I wonder if it's the same promo as last time. And we have Tick Away Dragon, so yeah, I believe you get the same two promos, like, grouped together whenever you pull it, so yeah. So let's get started with this box. Start with the left side. Alright, so first pack. Again, getting these boxes, I don't think it's really worth it for the set at the moment, but if you want to take a gamble and just have fun opening packs, I would recommend it. Black Dreams of Bania. Otherwise, I think it's uh, better if you guys just purchase singles of the set, especially if you're only looking for a certain few cards or to build a certain deck only, as I think this still goes for like standard retail price of a box, and you don't really get the best of stuff. So we get Retractor Serakiel. Uh, the main reason why I pre-ordered four boxes was mainly just for the Black Surf Gabriel playmat. Really wanted that. Mm, no, that's probably a pretty bad reason. But, yeah, that would be fun to open four boxes as well. And our first tripper is Cosmic Hero Grand Volver, so yay. Losing money already. Damn. Yeah, not the triple I really wanted out of the set. Or wanted at all. Hopefully, it becomes better. Got a Grand Drifter now. I think the main cards that people want from the set are the Generation Rare and the Angel Feather stuff, so yeah. Nigman. And we have the Scarface Lion. Not really a double I wanted either, but we can make do. I think with this set, uh, definitely a lot of cool support that's being offered in the set. Uh, hopefully some of the cards will rise in value as time goes on, but yeah. Definitely really excited for the new Bermuda Clan Booster coming out. So we have Grand Mantle. Squall. Squall. 